What's up guys? Steph here and welcome to day 11 of Vlogmas. I thought today was the 12th. Uh, it's 6 a.m. I just uh, got up. Well, I need to just get up, but I just finished packing and I am going to head out to work. I got to make a couple signs so I can post some closure signs. But I have on my camera gear for my filming and we're also um, we're also doing goodie bags today, so I need to figure that out, actually. Do I need anything for that? I don't think so. I feel very unprepared right now. Ugh, I hate that feeling. Okay, I just wanted to say good morning, and uh, we'll see how it goes today. I actually am expecting a much better day than yesterday. My head still feels a little bit not great. I can, I can feel it behind my eyes, but we're going to go with it. And you can't see me right now because the lights are off and I can't see anything. It's very dark. Where's the light switch? There it is. Okay. Oh, the cats. I feel so bad for the cats. Just because it's so early, I'm going to feed them. And it's going to be so early. But that's okay. They have dry food all the time. Okay. Let's get the day started. Yas. Hello, guys. It's uh, kind of late. It's 8.44. I just got home from work and it's raining really badly. The cats have been kind of outside when it's been wet, but not so much like when it's been raining. Look at this, how cute is this? Look, can you see their little footprints? Can you, oops, sorry, sorry Tess. Oh, you can't even, it's blurry. The camera doesn't know what I'm trying to focus on. Look, look, look. Look at these cute footprints. Do you see those? Those are cubes. Oh, he is so wet. Oh, cube, you're all wet. Look at these cute little footprints. Oh, aren't they so cute? Okay, you guys ready to come inside? There's Matt trying to figure out what's going on. He's like, no, 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 no. Hello, Narwhal. Hello, kitty cat. What are you doing? Okay. They're so cute, those cats. I feel bad because I got home so late. They've been cooped up in the house for a very long time. Okay. I was driving home and all I could think about was doing a live pack break, which I don't think I'm going to do tonight because it's so late, but I think I'm going to prep to try to do one tomorrow, but I think I'm going to try it a different way. So like, I've been toying with all these different things because like, I try to bundle them so that I can just charge shipping, but I think what I might do is instead of charging shipping on every order, I think what I might do is charge no shipping. But when you order, I'll put a disclaimer that it won't be shipped until you order shipping. And then that way you can, and like, because a lot of Pokemon pack breakers, like what they do is you, you buy something from them and they hold on to it until you want it to be shipped. That way you can like kind of buy multiple things. And so what I think I might do is have like pack breaks and then I'll have two shipping options whenever you're ready and want to ship. It'll be just like a bulk shipping op like option where if you want to ship all of your cards, then it'll be like, you know, up to six or seven packs will be whatever. I don't know. I have to do the math. And then, you know, whatever pound and more would end up being. I, I got to um, weigh the packs to see, like, how many packs equals a pound. Because then a pound would be, like, $10 shipping because that's it usually costs, like, $11. i will I'll eat some costs. I don't care. Um, and then there could be an option of just, like, your good cards. So, like, your, your any, like... You know, GX, V, V Max, Full Art, all the secret rares, all those things. Um, plus your reverse hollows and then any rare cards. So um, it could be like, you know, hollow rares, non hollow rares. Um, and then that can be an option with just those cards because some people don't actually want their bulk. And then that can be an even cheaper option. So for shipping, like you could probably have like 10 to 15 packs of cards with just the good cards. And then that would just be like $3 because really in reality, you know, 10 packs of just the good cards would just be basically like 30 cards. I don't know. Anyways, these are the things I think about when I'm driving home. Obviously, doing live breaks is like one of the things that I am enjoying the most, most recently in my life. It's like the thing that makes me happy because I get to hang out with you guys. I get to open up Pokemon cards and it helps, you know, support me a little bit. So that's nice. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to tell you guys that. Anyways, I did a lot of filming today at work. Am I, this is how you know when I'm filming, because I have my Iron, my Iron Man backpack. It's a backpack I use to keep my camera gear in, which is terrible. It does not protect my, 
camera gear at all. I'm in the process of looking for a, um, a case for my Weeble. So my, my, um, oh God, what is it called? You know my thing? My gimbal. <laughs> the thing that keeps my camera thing. Camera straight. So I'm excited because I, uh, we had a new park that opened or new playground that opened. It was, it's been closed for renovations and it opened today. And I'm hoping I got some really cool shots. So I'm excited to upload those and see what they look like. Fingers crossed that they look good. And then, yeah, but I'm excited. I'm, I'm hoping for, I was gonna say a work-free work weekend, but I definitely have some things that I have to do. But maybe I'll try to do those early tomorrow. And then I wanna try to put, I, I still owe like seven people giveaway boxes. So I want to get everything taken care of with the good giveaways, cause then I can start fresh and start doing giveaways again. But I wanna make sure that I cover all the people that I owe first, so. Ah, what a day, what a day. Oh, and I have to do all my advent calendars. Ugh, advent calendars, jeez. Jeez, those advent calendars. I'm excited to open up Pokemon cards, though, for the advent calendars. Okay, guys. Well, I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. I think I need to eat something or do something. I need to pee, actually. I'm gonna pee. And get some water. I'm thirsty. I jumped today because I was trying to get a cobweb <laughs> with a Webster but it was really high up and it was on this extension pole, but I couldn't reach it. So I tried to like jump and reach it. And then my calves almost cramped up and I was like, oh, I'm dehydrated. I need to drink more water. So I'm gonna try to focus on drinking more water every day. Cause I have been getting headaches too. I don't think they're dehydration headaches cause I had a really bad one yesterday and I drank a ton of water. I think they're just headaches, but I'm sure water helps. I'm sure water helps a little bit and Tylenol. They, they both help together. Okay. The cats are like, they don't know what to do. Tess is all wet and she's just like, what? What am I supposed to do? Like, why am I, why does it feel like this? They don't really like water, usually. All right, see you guys in a little bit. Oh, why, hello there. Uh, welcome to our day 11 advent calendars. Future Steph here with my blue light glasses. Although, if I do ever need to get actual glasses, which I'm sure I do need to get, I'll probably get a style similar to this because I actually really like, all my sunglasses are this shape. Um, yeah, and I like these. Anyways, let's go ahead and get this party started. Since my camera's already a little bit tilted, let's go ahead and start off with our Pokemon pack opening. This is another pack of, oh wait, what is this? Vivid Voltage. Yeah, so this is another pack of Vivid Voltage. A couple days ago I opened the one that had the, the Weezing, I think. This one has the um, Applin and the Appleton. Applin, Applin. Um, so let's go ahead and see, this is our blister pack. There's our code card. Boom, boom, bam. And then we're gonna keep these promos because I haven't had these ones yet. I'm gonna put these promos in my Vivid Voltage collection here to put in my little portfolio case. And then we got another Raichu coin. So all the, oops, all the coins must be very similar. All right, all right, let's check out, what is it, Celebi? Focus the camera and let's see if we can get that hyper rare V Max Chunky Chew. Now we pulled a few days ago, we got a Zamazenta, which was really nice. Amazing and rare. Ah, we got another green code card. So this is a blister pack, so there's a chance that we can pull another amazing rare. I think the chances are pretty slim, but one can hope, yeah? So let's all just hope that we got an amazing rare because I think that's a secret rare. So it's one of the fun things that you can get when you get a green code card. But I would say that we'd be extremely lucky if we got another one. No, we got a Dusclops Reverse Hollow and a Bennett Regular Rare. Okay, so nothing great from that. Let's go into our Pokemon calendar. I know this is not a great view, but what day are we doing? We're gonna do day 11. Oh, we got a ditto! <gasps> I think this might be one of my favorite ones that we have gotten so far out of this thing. I'm not a huge fan of this calendar. I've said that a few times, but look at this purple ditto. I really want that shiny star V ditto, the, sh the shiny, full art shiny, where he's blue. Ah, oh, so cool. Okay, well, oh, I kind of want to leave him out. I'm not sure. I'll put him back in for now, but I kind of want to put him up on the desk. Let's go ahead and do our paka paka. We're doing our Kawaii Village one. Okay, so far I'm doing okay at collecting this set, as you can see above. 
Um, I don't even know what I'm hoping for, but maybe the sushi chef because we haven't we haven't gotten that one yet. I like can't my my focusing is just really not great. I don't know what's going on. Well, we'll just go with it. Okay, what did we get? Okay, we didn't get another, we got, a, it's not a duplicate, so that's good. We got the little, like, tea house. I don't know exactly what this is called. Um, I called it a tea house. That's very Chinese of me to say, to be honest, because I'm sure they have um, tea houses in Japan, but I don't think that's what this is called. Do they tell us? Oh, I think they tell us. Terra Terra, oh, it's a temple, is one of the many happy, welcoming temples found throughout Japan. Okay, Terra Terra is what we got. So we are still looking for the Tori here. Um, there's a Chase version of the egg. We need the Sushi Chef. We got the weird globe guy. We got, oh, we, we need the bonus figure. And then we need this Samurai Warrior. Oh, and the cat. I really want the cat. The key cat. The key cat. Oh, I want the gold key cat. <laughs> um, I want all of these, to be honest. They're all very nice. Okay, very cool. I don't know where we place. Let's put, we'll just put him right here. Okay, there you go. I like can't, I can't even remember what we're even doing right now. What is this, day 11? Did we already do day 11? No. Okay, so we're doing our um, Disney mystery pin advent calendar. We have day 11. What do you guys think we got? I'm gonna guess that we got 101 Dalmatians. Ugh, we got Goofy, okay. Well, I almost said Pluto, which would have been closer than 101. Actually, 101 Dalmatians, Pluto are pretty close to Goofy because they're both they're all dogs, so not that far off. All right, and then we already did our Pokemon one. We have to do our sock advent calendars. Odd day is our men's Harry Potter socks, and then the Kawaii women's socks. So let's go ahead and do the men's one first. Uh, we're gonna do day six. And it says Ravenclaw, so I'm assuming there's going to be Ravenclaw socks. Yes. Okay, we have crew socks this time. And these are blue crew socks that represent Ravenclaw. I might have to start putting, because I don't need this many socks. I still have some, I still have some uh, brand new socks from last year's advent calendar. So I might start putting those in like giveaway boxes or something. Okay, we have our Kawaii Harry Potter. Dobby is free is what's on here. So maybe we got some Dobby socks. Oh, I don't know what we, oh, yes, yes. I love this calendar. This one's been really good to us. I love this color. So we got crew socks again, and this says free Dobby, but they're purple. I love the purple and gray mixture of the sock colors. Oh, I love these. Okay, I'm a fan of that. All right, is that all the advent calendars? I think so. Guys, thank you so much for joining me on day 11. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna get my act together. I'm working on it. So I hopefully can do this like day of and post the video actually in a timely manner. Uh, thank you for your patience. Thank you for watching. And I will see you guys tomorrow for day 12. See you guys later. Bye.